What's up everybody, Cox Gaming here with a new episode of Tier 13 Attack Strategy for today, a new attack strategy for more agency, the Zep Hybrid, still works, still strong, if you want to participate in the free battle pass giveaway next month, don't forget to write the code I will say during the video in the comments. If you want to support the channel, check the channel membership and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new, smash that like button, turn the bell for notifications so you won't miss anything in the future. And let's begin with the attack strategy. So starting of course with the lightning spells on top of the scatter shot. You want to always go for the scatter shot with the lightning spells before starting with the attack. Then you're doing the queen walk. Clearing everything that you can. You can see the king now dropped it on the bottom. He put the baby dragon. Now the queen will gonna clear everything and I think she's gonna get the eagle artillery as well. She's not gonna escape from it. She will afterwards, she will go for the air defense. Now the siege barracks on the bottom left corner. That way everybody can uh, focus on the town hall. All the miners and the hog riders. Now starting with all of them. Grand Warden behind. Where's the royal champion? Here she is. And you trigger the Grand Warden ability. In the middle of the, in the 50% HP of the town hall, I would say. Poison in the CC, on top of the super minions. And of course, you have one freeze, so we use it on top of a multi inferno or on top of a scatter shot. Either way are good. I would say it's better for the scatter shot because it's doing much more damage than the multi inferno. So the world champion still got the ability. And now she is almost full HP. She can definitely clear, clear everything here. Now we can use the ability. Don't know why he's not doing it. Can take everything. But you can see. Very easy to do. 3 star. You just need to funnel. And clear everything you can. And then release all the hybrid. In front of the town hall. Depends on which base. This is the second replay. Starting with the Zep. Taking out the right scatter shot. Now from the top, Ice Golem with a few balloons and a queen walk. Ice Golem was meant because of all the traps. So bases like this when the town hall is near the scatter shots and on the corner next to the clan castle. Usually it's a trap base. So always make sure you're starting with Ice Golem. Gonna clear all... Uh, I think the queen can take the town hall. Yeah, definitely she can take the town hall from there. Just need to use probably one rage spell. As you can see, it triggered the queen ability. Because of the eagle artillery, if you do it before it shoots the first missile, they will trigger... the eagle artillery will target someone else. If you didn't know it. Now starting from the left. With the siege barracks. And now we can start the hog riders and the miners. And they will just go straight to the middle. To the inferno. To the multi. Royal champion will take out the scatter shot. Unlike before. He is leaving the eagle artillery for last. Didn't use the king ability. Still got it. It will help taking out the king. Very nice. No more spells left. I don't see. Maybe there's a giant bomb uh, there. So probably it will take out all the hog riders. But you got the king outside clearing everything. And the code info today will be easy peasy. Nicely done. Probably you will need a few rounds to practice with it. But I, I can assure you. You can 3 star any base in wars, you just need to find the correct ones. If all the infernos are on single, it's the best. So mostly the miners are alive, all the hog riders were gone. Now the king with the rest of the barbarians can take everything, it's only one archer tower and one cannon. Great and easy attack strategy, try it out before, just get to know with the troops and how they work. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you on the next one. 
See ya!